after beating the brother of Jackson Mahomes, we have footage of Tom Brady getting extremely intoxicated. Let's Woo! go! Let's go, Tom! He, celebrate! He deserves it! Tom Brady does deserve it, man. He clushed it up. He's a real... What, 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 how would you describe what Tom Brady's done? MVP. MVP. Goat. The the goat status. The goat status, man. Hey, we're back. Burke, you're looking good with your fresh haircut, thank man. You, thank you. Same with you, man. Thank, thank you, thank, thank you. you. Yeah. Yeah. Chris? Hey. Hey. I'm, I'm just getting into the story. Yeah, I'm, I'm, getting, I don't, I'm not getting a haircut. Right Chris, you're trying to grow it out to eventually get to the Travis Scott hairstyle. In no, which he's, you go, he's going for the Kodak Black. <laughs> yeah, I'm going for Kodak Black look. <laughs> All right, make sure to subscribe. Hit that he's going for the corn balls on his head. He's going for corn balls. Get it? Because like corn, yeah, because I said corn ball one time. You don't even say joke. Ah! Chris missed me. We met, we, we've we been gone for a little bit. He's, you know he slept in my bed? He did? <laughs> he missed me so much he slept in my bed. It's not going to fucking miss you. It's not going to fucking have one. That's the only reason why I fucking <laughs> slept on it. All right, real quick. Cut to a real guys. quick still image of uh, Chris's bed. <laughs> Hi <laughs> right, guys, make sure to subscribe. Hit that notification bell and follow us on Instagram. It'll be linked down below. Big things happening on the podcast channel. If you guys can find it on Apple Podcasts and Spotify. Just look up the Sync Podcast. All right, boys, ready to go? Let's do it. Let's go. All right, let's get into it. Here's the first clip that came out from the parade uh, in Tampa Bay. Tom, how awesome was that? <laughs> bro, bro, he looked like he just necked the fifth and like Boo Blue's just wife. <laughs> <laughs> he just looks like he's having a great ass time. That great looks time. like how that looks like somebody after they got their seventh ring. <laughs> yeah, yeah. He, he spent all the years, dude. He's done now. He, yeah. just, he, he doesn't give. A f he's not even done. He's still coming <laughs> he's back really next walking season. Like a baby goat, he's but like, he actually <laughs> is the real goat. It's like that sober friend taking care of a drunk friend. <laughs> yeah. yeah. All right, let's keep it going. This guy's the goat. The goat's just all shriveled up and <laughs> yeah. just drunk off his ass. The grin. The grin's the best part. Yeah, yeah that's how you know you're really fucked up. Yeah, he has his glasses on to cover up that he's like super fucked and up. Incredibly intoxicated. It's yeah. so funny how him and Rob are teammates and Rob is just so open to him being <laughs> yeah. drunk and, yeah. and Tom is just not having it. I think what it is is obviously we know he moved to Florida. Yeah, he's exactly. like moving to Florida changes a man. Exactly. <laughs> Usually when he wins the Super Bowl, it's cold as fucking Boston right now. If yeah. you move to Florida, you become a part-time crackhead. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> all right, let's keep it going. Tom, how often was that? Tom Brady, Super Bowl MVP, seven times. Yeah. <laughs> <Bro>. <laughs> Tom Brady, Super Bowl MVP, seven times. <laughs> the fucking, like, fucking you can hear the reporter in the background just being like, seven-time MVP, Super Bowl champion, Tom Brady. <laughs> yeah, and he's getting carried out by his best friend. <laughs> I don't think that's his best friend, dude. I think it's somebody it's literally, literally like, security guard. It's like security guard. It's like their job <laughs> for Tampa Bay to make sure their players aren't like, it's like talking. Your whole, it's like the holdback guy on yeah, the yeah. sidelines, but it's like hold back Tom Brady. Yeah, it's like the guy that will always talk to the girl that has a boyfriend when he's drunk, yeah. and his friend's holding him back. Yeah. How yeah. the f like, if you look at the video of him in the locker room after they won, he wasn't doing shit, yeah. and now he's like fucking drunk as fuck at a parade. Yeah. yeah. <laughs> if you're paparazzi, like, you just hit a gold mine, right? You just, you're looking for the MVP to come out, and he comes out extremely fucked up. <laughs> yeah, and they're still trying to ask him questions, which is hilarious. <laughs> <laughs> just, okay, it's like all these uh, ESPN reporters, you have the MSNBC, right? And then suddenly out of corner comes Fletcher. Like, he's yeah. up. <laughs> All right, then Tom Brady actually responded to it, said nothing to see here, just a little uh, avocado tequila. <laughs> <laughs> avocado tequila? Avocado, avocado, avocado tequila. Avocado tequila? It sounds like you can order that at fucking Chipotle or something. <laughs> it sounds rich people shit, I don't even know. Anything with avocado just has to be fucking a little bit more money. Yeah, I think that, I think that's like a New England, like, rich pe person thing, you know? New like England? In what are you talking about? That's probably like bottom barrel fucking alcohol. Then why is Tom Brady drinking? It's avocado tequila. Wait, look it up, look it up, look it up. All right, it's this. He was drinking this. Of course he's drinking something nah, somewhat healthy, though, No, no, too. no. He, he's lying. He's, cause that's what he usually drinks to get drunk. He definitely was on some vodka. <laughs> all right, let's get back into it. There was a ton of different angles on all, like, all day Tom was messed up. We have so many of these crazy-ass, like, moments from the day, bro. Big old boat Oh, parade. no fucking way. Wait, wait. No, what don't, the fuck? No! Go. Bro, imagine if that just fell straight in the water. Well, imagine if that hit somebody in the fucking head. <laughs> yeah, he yeah. like gets super drunk and then he murders someone after the game. Yeah. <laughs> not murdered. <laughs> but that's like, a little dark. I mean, just like he maybe like a bruise. Mean, I, mean, I mean, the guy can throw harder imagine, than anybody else. Imagine like, like not getting a concussion the whole NFL season and you get a <laughs> concussion from the Lombardi trophy. <laughs> You're getting like Tom Brady gets a concussion from just being fucked up. He <laughs> yeah. just gets drunk. Yeah. Oh. Good. Okay. Touchdown. He's so hammered. Bro, it's literally like if you do something wrong in front of your parents, you're like, oh shit, I shouldn't have done that. Yeah. He's like walking away. Yeah, and then his kid's just sitting there on the side of the boat. Yeah. yeah. All right, let's keep it going. Here's some more angles. This is them in a crowd with the, holding his daughter. Hey! Oh, shit. He, just, he did the cheetah deuce. Yeah. <laughs> 
<laughs> What's the cheetah deuce? He's it's Tyree kills deuce. Wait, what is that from? It's like Tyree kill his celebration before he, like, he touched. He like ran like a ninety yard touchdown and like did a deuce sign to one of the fucking Will, Tampa Bay players. Winfield and then and then Winfield did it in the Super Bowl and like got a penalty to for Tom it. Brady and so Tom Brady just now mocking it. No, oh, fuck, what? Man. I'm sorry, I don't know. Oh, I don't Tom know. Brady. Stick the fucking cricket, Kai. I don't watch cricket. Stick the fucking math. <laughs> Math. <laughs> <laughs> Go back to Kumon, you fucking pussy. Okay. Oh, that's a store. Kumon's not a store. <laughs> you no, know, I've seen like the fucking little smiley face, derpy looking shit. Like, is that the? the, the Kumon. <laughs> <laughs> no, Kumon is like literally you have like your personal tutor to teach you math. That's the yeah, shit. My like, that was like, like my mom like, owned one. That's yeah. a store. That's why. Yeah. I said, <laughs> It was next to that subway on our field trip. Kai, right? Kai's mom owned him, and Kai wouldn't go to fucking baseball practice. He would go to fucking Kumon. <laughs> <laughs> We're not racist. We're just friendly to our friends, okay? Exactly, guys. You see, I knew that they own a Kumon. So that's why I said math. <laughs> but, you, but you guys automatically thought I was being racist <laughs> at home, okay? All right, let's keep not it going. Not cool, guys. Fuck you. <laughs> <laughs> Okay, but pretty much Kai, Kai. Oh yeah, you gotta explain this. This is the Tyreek celebration. Tyreek did it to them when they whooped their ass midseason. Winfield, who's the safety for the Buccaneers, did it back to him at Tyreek Hill on during the Super Bowl, got a flag, and they're doing it again. Oh, as like funny thing. The defender did it back to Tyreek Hill after they like like made a play, and then he got a flag, and then Tom Brady's like, "Fuck it, I'm gonna do it because I won, and you're a pussy, basically." Oh, and. Berkeley talk, bro. Yeah. It is. <laughs> I want to see like, I, I, you know, it's cra- gonna be crazy. Tom Brady's son snap story. <laughs> yeah. Tom Brady's kids go to the Super Bowl more than they go to their grandma's house. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> yeah. Honestly, Seriously. Hey, you imagine you go to a school and you got him on snap. That's gotta be nuts. You get to post all that shit and all everyone sees that. It's not just like kissing. Yeah. It's not just kissing your dad. It's gonna be like, what's some kissing your dad? Then it's like the post <laughs> Super Bowl celebration. Bro. <laughs> Damn it. Right, here's another clip from the boat. This is the back of the boat. Looks so funny, like it Tom. Just, we know the trophy's yours, but you can't fucking throw. Dude, this is so legendary, bro. You get to this point in life when you work all all these years, yeah. you need to do that. Like, what do you, what do you, what would you be doing if you won the Super Bowl like that? I'd I mean, be doing the exact same thing. Same but I'd shit. probably be carried out on a fucking stretcher. Yeah. yeah. I mean, seven, bro. You gotta celebrate, man. Yeah. yeah. And Tom Brady's never done stuff like this before. He's never he, like Gronk has always been the one that's like been the party guy. Yeah. He's doing it now, bro. If he gets like, what if he gets like eleven rings? Like, where is he gonna put his? No, he can't ring? do that, right? Bro, if he gets a, like, like that's four more years. That's impossible, right? I don't know. Impossible. Or if he gets eleven rings, he has to like put one of his rings on his cock. He's like a cock <laughs> Super Bowl ring. Yeah, like he goes to a restaurant. And they're like, Mister Brady, can I see your ring, please? <laughs> yeah. He's like, he's like I have ten. He's like, oh, where's your eleventh? <laughs> <laughs> Just, okay. fucking guys. Well, what if his cock so long he could put all ten of them on? There? Oh my god! And then he and it's kind of like a you know how Chinese people used to count stuff by guys. Them in he's just gonna put two rings on a, another finger. Fuck off with this penis shit. Shut the fuck up, God. <laughs> I, I, so that's one wants to go over because Tom Brady did win his seventh, and we never really get to see that happen. That was that that, that was sick. That was, was awesome. Sick. Yeah, it was awesome. I hope you guys enjoyed the video. If you guys did, make sure to subscribe, hit the notification bell, and of course, if you guys want to see us get our cock rings, make sure to subscribe and listen to our podcast. It'll be linked down below. Also, <laughs> on Apple Podcasts and Spotify. We'll see you guys next time. Peace out, guys. Woo! Peace. Peace.